Overgrown grass, toppled headstones, and illegal dumping. A horrifying sight for families with loved ones buried at Mount Carmel Cemetery in South Memphis. Hello, I'm Greg. Her Stephanie is off tonight. Our records show that this is not the first time there have been complaints about that gravesite. WREG's Bria Jones joins us now live with a look at the current conditions after talking with a woman desperately in need of help. What did she have to say, Bria? Well, Greg, our records show that we have been investigating the conditions at Mount Carmel Cemetery for years. Now, this family says this is the worst it's ever looked. Dilapidated headstones, down trees, and dumping have taken over Mount Carmel Cemetery at the corner of Elvis Presley and Elliston in South Memphis. It's very disappointing. It's disheartening. Debbie Hoskins desperately wants to lay flowers at her mother's grave. Usually, she says her brother has cut a path to the plot, but says this past Mother's Day, with the wild weeds and debris, it was just too dangerous. No one should ever have to come and pay respect to their loved one to a cemetery that looks like this. Last year, WREG was told by city and county officials a total of $30,000 would go to improve conditions at five cemeteries, including Mount Carmel. Given the current situation, I asked Shelby County Commissioner Eddie Jones what happened. Here's how laps happen in government. So governments change over. You get new commissioners, you get a new mayor, you get new judges. Jones says the main issue is the property has no owner. Because there are no owners, it, uh, the city and the county was taking turns uh, doing the maintenance on it. Years ago, he says a judge ruled the county is to be responsible for maintaining the dignity of the dead. Recently, Jones says he toured the gravesite with a concerned constituent. He says the grass was cut not too long ago, but admits more needs to be done. Maybe we need to put some security cameras up because there's a lot of illegal dumping where it's supposed to be sacred. If uh, it can be cleaned up, my spirit will be overjoyed. Jones says he plans to introduce a joint resolution with the city for more funding on Wednesday. His goal is to maintain several of the cemeteries and get them cut a few times during growth season. For now, reporting live downtown, Bria Jones, WREG News, Channel 3.